everyone, welcome back to episode three of Dying hey, Light. Zara checked me out and gave me another shot. Okay, great. Not out to hold you for a while, which is good because I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. So, time for a real trial. Go talk to Spike. You'll find him near Zara's truck. He's got the first real job for you. Awesome. All right, what's the job? Tell me all about it. Hey, Spike. I'm Crane. Just what I need. More unskilled labor. All right, shut up and pay attention. There are two types of airdrops. One has food, first aid supplies, survival gear and such. The other kind is filled with antizen. The GRE sends in a one-way video feed that lets us know when they're on the way. Look, the trouble is, the airdrops with antizen keep getting raided by Rise's thugs. And without antizen, we're basically screwed. Mm -hmm. Rise and his boys only operate during the day because going out after dark is a dandy way to get killed. But the next two antizen drops are coming down right at sunset tonight. And Brecken means to go after them. This may be our only chance to reach the airdrop. What's my part here? Well, as I said, going out at night is basically suicide. Or it would be if I hadn't been setting up safe zones and traps out there for weeks now, which I have. Now, Brecken and his team will be okay tonight so long as you get out there now and arm those traps. That's your part. All right. What are these traps and how do I arm them? You'll see. I'll be talking you through it. Just remember, without these traps, Brecken won't survive the night. And if he doesn't come back with Antizen, we are lost. Before you head out there, grab some firecrackers. Made them myself. They make a fine distraction if you get in trouble. All right, that sounds like a plan. I'm going to try and use them when I can and see what they do with these uh, zombies that are crawling around all over the place. I'm actually wondering what's going to happen when uh, the night time comes around and if they're finally going to start moving around a little bit quicker than they are during the day. Okay, search dead bodies, chests, chests, abandoned cars, pieces of furniture, blah, 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 to find weapons, money, and components. Okay. And, oh, that's nice. Prisky to use five or cents to identify objects you can loot. Nice. What about this? Search in the environment for huge, okay. So, uh, usually rooftops feel interesting. Okay, cool. So, I'll be exploring the place as I play, and I'm sure I'll get to know it quite well. Um, at the moment, the game isn't too scary. Like I said, I don't particularly love scary games, but <laughs> this one seems to be okay thus far. I've got my pipe, and I'm ready. I'm ready for anything that comes out at me, and I'm going to go through the bins because, of course, what would life be without searching through bins in this game? Only. Only. <laughs> um, I can hear them screaming around. It's just so, uh, so weird that there's like okay, nobody around. Okay, the car. Open the hood, connect the battery, that'll arm the trunk. Oh, what are these batteries? Can I grab those from the trunk? No, no, no. Okay, well, I'm just going to go to the hood and uh, pop that open. Done. Alright, well, that was easy. Is anyone outside right now? Urgent help needed. Oh yes, plenty um, of zombies. I'm outside. I'm working for Spike. You're Crane, right? Listen, our runners tried to secure one of our safe houses for Brecken's mission. He's in a courtyard by Vefa and Mimar, surrounded by zombies. We gotta help him. Wow. All right, I'm on it. Okay then. Uh. I think they're all surrounded by zombies, but does it look like it's getting darker, or is it just the angle that I'm viewing the sun at? Oh! Hello, sweetheart. Alright. 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 Oh, gee, that's for a while. She bent my pipe. Totally bent. Okay, there's another dude coming around. Hello there. Oh, <laughs> Gee, I have to work on my stamina, huh? I'm getting really, really tired and puffed out. Is that his skull on the bottom? Oh, gee, it's definitely his skull. Blood squirting out everywhere. Oh, another one. What's this one? She's going out dancing something? I don't know. What is she doing? She's got a bikini on and skirt. She's getting dressed and she got bitten, obviously. <laughs> oh, I'm out of combat stamina. She dead. She's dead. What have you got? $73. Well, hello. Seven bucks. Worthless. You are worthless. Okay, about 73 bucks. Not bad. Not bad. I wonder if it's just random or they will be a little bit harder to kill. Um, at the moment, they're all really slow. I'm in favor of that. I like it. I think they're just easing us into the game 
which is something I like. What about you, standing, working corners, just trying to sell some drugs or something? Let's see how much money you've got. Zombie drugs. Let's have a look. Seven bucks! No, nope. you were nobody. You were nobody. Oh yeah, let's search through the bin. Maybe the bin will have a bit more. What did I get? Nothing? Oh, there's another one waiting there. Oh, he's got a deep voice. Oh, I have to repair my weapon? Oh, nice. I see. We're lucky that it takes so long for the zombie to get up. I wish that uh, they had kind of more... I guess it adds to the mood and all that, but I kind of wish... Smash him in. Kicking doesn't really do anything, does it? It's not like Far Cry 4 where you can kick an elephant to death. I got my anchor out there. <laughs> uh, it's okay. What have you got? 18 bucks. Eh, not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Um, yeah, about the music. It's just like if we stayed quiet right now, just I'll give it like five seconds. Okay, first I'm gonna have a look at the skills. It's telling me that I've got a skill that I can unlock. Okay. Nice. Nice. Sounds good. Survivor. What does that do? Learn how to craft the most basic things needed for survival. Yes. Yes. Thank you. That's exactly what I need. Um, yeah, it's kind of like really, I guess, eerie and quiet. And all you can hear is just the zombies walking around. I kind of wish that there was like a toggle switch that would allow you to do that. Or if you're in like, you're feeling a bit crazy, you know, you just want to get more energy. Whoa. <laughs> Where did you come out from? Did that one just run out at me? I didn't notice. Um, but if I wanted some more, you know, energy, felt, combative uh, kind of mood, I wish that there was more like energetic music, something, I don't know. I, I'm not that picky, just something, you know, to, to keep me company in the game. Does that make sense? Because I am walking around by myself with a pipe. <laughs> Mental parts, I'll take that. Awesome. All right. What is this? Oh, cash register. Will I be able... 122 bucks? Nice. An old fridge. What is this stuff? Coffee. Nice. Halva. Okay. And alcohol. Yes. Sounds good. Sounds very good. I wonder kind of alcohol it was. I'm not sure. I'm going towards that orange spot. I don't know. It, like, it seems that uh, one direction that I'm facing, it seems like it's still nice and bright outside. And as soon as I turn, it kind of looks like nighttime is coming. And uh, I'm, I'm a bit worried about what's going to happen during the nighttime. Are they all going to start running? How am I going to defend myself with a pipe that gets broken and I have to fix? Um, hopefully by that time, I'll be able to pick up some awesome new weapons. But I'm just really exploring now and trying to get to know the game a little bit more. Uh, they said we can search things in the cars. Can we open this up? Oh, cool. I can. All right. Oh, bag. More clothes or 16 bucks. What? Is that all? Oh, I, I would have thought that in uh, kind of luggage bags, you'd find kind of more items in there. But uh, perhaps not. Hmm, I must say the um, game is just so fluid. I'm really impressed thus far and I haven't, uh, I guess you could say, mastered the controls of it yet because it's only like the first, well, how long <laughs> How long were the other gameplays? Like 20 minutes? So this is like the first hour of playing and it already feels quite uh, comfortable in use, which is which is really nice. Okay, I heard Jade, some I'm here, along with some infected. Watch yourself, Craig. I'm watching myself. Oh, there it is. It's like, I know you're up there on the roof. I'm waiting for you. All right, there are two down here. I'm pretty sure there are two. Where are they? Oh, there you go. Is she naked? No, nope, she's the one. Oh, there you go. Whoa, this is psycho. Nope. Oh, well, they're still around. She's swinging with her one arm. I think they've each got one arm on the opposite side. <laughs> one's got a right arm, one's got a left arm. Together, they are one zombie. Uh... Oh, cool. I can see the skeleton. Is that for better aim or something? I'm out of combat stamina. I'm falling back. Oh, yeah. K 
Come on. Oh, oh, did you see the shards of the skull just fall around everywhere? Oh, it's so gruesome. I cannot believe how gruesome this is. Oh, man. All right. I, I think I'm here. Um, wonder who's inside. Uh, I'm not going to walk in there. It looks I think suspicious. It's too late for yep. This guy. Yep. Come on. Right. I'm going to agitate you a bit. Come running out. I don't want to walk in there. Don't let him suffer. I won't let him suffer. Let's aim for the head. Oh, yeah. Oh. Took the top chunk out at first, and now the whole okay, head done. just rolled. Fuck. No choice. He wasn't human anymore. Now hurry. You still need to turn on the light. Uh -huh. That's the only way to make this place safe at night. All right. We are turning the lights on. Nice. Ah oh, shit. What now? What's going on? Somebody tried to contact us, but we couldn't pick up. Got to get up into our next sector here. So I just ran over here to make it a bit quicker. Otherwise, this gameplay would be at least an hour long before I finish the mission. <laughs> Crane here. Report. Okay, I met this doctor, scientist type. They've got him set up in a sort of research trailer, and he's working on a cure for the virus. His name is Zera. Hello? Do you copy? Affirmative. Secondary objective added. Maintain your cover and secure all of his research. Acknowledge. Your stolen file still takes top priority though, right? Affirmative. We find it unlikely that a single researcher working out of a trailer could produce any significant results. But if he does, we want to see it. Oh, wow. All right. First assignment. Jade, it's done. Good. We'll need to prepare more places like that one. Okay. We've got more spots picked out for future safe zones. Spike will mark them on your map later. Awesome. And Crane. Thank you. Back to you, Spike. Right now, you need to get back to our main task and arm the next trap. There's another car close by. Got it. All right. So our first mission really got interrupted by another mission for Jade. So it was like a mission within a mission. Oh, hang on. What's with all these zombies down here? They're all over the street. So what does that tell you? Keep off the street. Try to stay on the rooftops. What? They can't reach you. How? But how am I going to get they're them to move? They're all the car, Spike. You still have some firecrackers, don't you? All right. Just throw some into the crowd. Those dead bastards are easily distracted. Okay, sounds like a plan. I'll uh, I'll do that. I want to help. <laughs> They're going to react to that. Are they going to? Uh, okay. Let me see how to equip this stuff. Do 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 do. Okay, that's the. Nope. That that's it. They seem to be the firecrackers now. Um, now where to where to place these? Over there? Are they all gonna run towards it? Yeah, there's something. Okay, great. They're moving. They are moving away from the car. Um, and maybe over there for the other side. Oh no, half of them are turning back. Don't turn back. I thought you got easily distracted, damn it. Just go to the firecracker that's on right now. And they're so slow. I'm gonna need to throw down like 20 before they move. Damn, five meters. Come on, zombies. Hurry up. Gee, I'm getting impatient. <laughs> Come on. Off you go. It's like herding. I don't know. Even animals are much quicker. What about this stray? Come on. Off to the right. Join the crowd. Follow your friends. That's the way. All right. I'm sure he's going to be... I'm just going to quickly go and do it. If I get bitten... I've already been bitten anyway. So I'm going to get out of here. And at least that is now done. Look at him. It's so slow. <laughs> I bet this is going to change. There is another car which I need to get to. So, yep, they're all moving right along. Ah, uh, there's still a massive crowd there. Come on, guys. <laughs> Damn it. I'm really going to need to craft some more firecrackers. Oh, there's some baskets here. Let's explore through those first. What's this? Halva? Oh, nice. Okay, so it gives me a bit of a health boost. And more. Okay, another health boost. Nice. I'm just going to snack, you know, like whilst you guys move along. Come on. That's it. That's it. The others are... What about the burning car? Like, you'd think that they'd be going towards the burning car because it's on fire. But a little firecracker makes them more excited. I wonder if it's... It's obviously not the light. It's probably just the sound. 
that it makes, which makes perfect sense. All right, they all come. <laughs> Oh boy, this is so slow. He's coming right at me. Okay, well, you do that. I'm just gonna try and get this job done very quickly. Oh, I'm getting out. Spike, these freaks are everywhere. If I need to use a trap, how do I activate it? You can't. I told you they're only for the night mission. Okay. Shit. Okay. I'm just a noob here, I guess, in this land of zombies, and uh, they won't send me on a night mission yet. You know what? And I kind of appreciate that because I really need to uh, get to. Oh man, dark spot! Is there a zombie right there? Oh, okay, just hell and stuff. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, sure. Just uh, die on the spikes. <laughs> Next place. <laughs> Almost there. Ooh, luck picking. Nice! Something new to try. I'm usually pretty good at sensing these and trying to open them up, so... Oh, nice! Nice. Nothing like in Assassin's Creed where we couldn't even lockpick because our skill wasn't good enough, no matter what. This was kind of more realistic, and I like how that worked. Okay. Uh, plane pipe. I'm just trying to compare what I've got in comparison to what I just picked up. Uh, plane pipe, but adjustable wrench. Uh, damage 39, damage 31. Okay, well, uh, adjustable wrench is what I shall uh, have. And I'm sure that we may have, or maybe not, uh, have a variety of slots. Um that uh, we can swap the weapons between... I'm not really worried what at the moment. What a contraption you got here. Three times brighter than an ordinary street lamp. Gives the infected quite the sunburn. It's... Uh, I'm not really worried at the moment. Um, I've got the pipe in my hand. I should have... But anyway, I'm not really worried at the moment. Um, because it seems like anything will do the job with these kind of zombies. I wonder if they will evolve somehow over time. Is it a headless one just standing there? It's impossible. How about the high voltage? Alright, where do we need to go now? There's two more spots to which we need to get to. He's having a snooze in the middle of the day. Wake up, buddy! Oh! See what I mean? Uh, one swing! Actually, I like that, you know? You can aim at different body parts. I wonder if I aim at the arms and legs, if they will start falling off just randomly too. Gee, there's so many of these things that I need to switch on. Preparing for night time. Hopefully that will give me some good bonus points with everybody and the whole crew. So they'll send me out to some new places. What is this? An abandoned train station? Or train kind of holding place? Wow, how am I going to get up there? This must be... It, it's funny because when you need to get to a particular spot and it's kind of like a maze, it, it reminds me of Prince of Persia. And I used to love that series. That was a series that I started playing when I was really little and that was that was damn good back in the day. That was brilliant. I don't know, have any of you played Prince of Persia back in the day? And I enjoyed every single one up until they made that cartoon version and I think it just went all downhill from there and they just scrapped it um obviously i haven't heard any new ones coming out after that as far as i know um okay lights are all set you ready for the next one then better hurry awesome yeah i've got that game and hey, oops Grant, guess what <laughs> i'm up on a balcony and i got eyes on you from here looks like you're doing okay for a newbie <laughs> gee thanks all right just try and get back here in one piece all right I don't want to have to train somebody to replace you. All right, I'll try. It's getting it's it's getting dark. I is it just it's getting dark. I think Oh. I got to start running at me soon. I'm so scared. I should not be playing this game in the middle of the night with everything pitch and dark. I reckon if somebody just came up behind me right now and just it just even touched me, I'd be screaming. I don't know. I think it's just that that anticipation that you have. Um, I guess it helps that I talk and 
do the commentary. <laughs> Otherwise, uh, if I just, you know, sat down and heavily focused on the game. Oh, <laughs> that would be crazy. Fuck, Spike, the whole goddamn district went down. What the hell's going on? Great. <sighs> Not again. All right, listen. There's a power substation here. Go check it out. Okay. Ah, this mission is never ending. It just keeps on going and going. All right. Uh, great. So now all the lights are out. And uh, I just didn't, didn't want to run through the whole city again. So I, I got to the power station. Okay. Is that what I need to do? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on? What is this? What is that? Whoa, that's like a master zombie um the first zombie boss i don't know it's something who's that on the floor do i need to grab something from them i, d I don't know i just I, he's swinging some huge weapon oh what's that gas pipe uh plane pipe whatever any pipe's gonna do right now oh luck pick i'm so glad that they can't climb on top of buildings that is like a massive advantage What's in here? Cigarettes. Okay. Awesome. Oh, who's this guy? Who is he? Honestly, he's massive. He's just waiting for me. So I don't care. I don't care at all. You need to get down here. Whoa! Oh, shit. I'm trying to aim at his head, <laughs> but it doesn't seem to be working. Where I'm really trying. I, I mean, it's it, it is getting him to some extent. But I just want to get him like right, right in the face, right in I don't know somewhere in the face, the temple. Wall. Oh crap! Whoa, I'm a bit knocked out. I how am I gonna? Whoa! How am I gonna? Oh, great. There's another little zombie friend that's coming out. It's nice. You've got friends. Good to know. Oh, I'm glad he slowed down by that big weapon. Oh, crap. I don't... Uh, seriously, how... Maybe... Okay, this is what I, This is my plan. I'm gonna... Since he can't walk fast, I got him to walk around the corner. And hopefully he won't notice. What does this guy have? Nothing of interest. Okay, so... Okay, good. I'll get in here. Oh boy. It's gonna have zombies jumping out at me. That's, that's the most thing that I'm afraid of at the moment. That all of a sudden one will jump out and surprise me somewhere. <laughs> What's in here? Lockpick. I'm getting all these lockpicks, but I haven't broken any, so. <laughs> awesome. Okay. More blueprints. Nice. Okay, uh, what does this door lead to? I'm gonna open it. Where does it go? Oh, it leads to the outside, but didn't you just walk around the corner? Oh, it is totally outside the fenced area. Anything in here? Nope. I'm gonna go back. Can I close that door? What if it comes around the other corner and just and decides to smash me? I don't want that to happen. Uh, where else do I need to go? Is there anything else here? Uh, I can't see it. I'm pressing Q <laughs> to see if it leads me in the right direction. Oh, there's another chest here. Uh, let's do it. There we go. That was good. That was good. Alright, what's in here? What coffee? And a cigar? Yeah, it's close. Cigarettes and a adjustable wrench. Nice, okay. I'm ready. Definitely does not compare to the weapon the weapon that he's got, but he can whack me with it. Pretty hard. Obviously he's not mobile with it. Wait, where do I need to go? Okay. I thought so, because I Cause distribution panel, right? So I thought I had to be around him somewhere. Alright, let's go on. Alright, I've got the substation reset. But if the grid shorted once, you know it could happen again, right? You leave the electrical engineering to me, okay? Just get your ass to a safe zone. You're gonna have to spend the night there. Uh-oh. It's dark. It's dark. 
Okay. Uh, I'm just... I, I'm lucky that I have a torch. And... I, I'm a bit weary now. I really am. Is there anybody here? I'm gonna try and stay... Up high. Oh, come on. Stop it with your singing. Uh, I'm up at a building somewhere now. Which is good. Almost at the safe zone. Might as well pick things up on the way. Oh, nice. I needed that. I need to collect that. There's not many around. And another skill. Agility. Dodge incoming attacks. Yeah. Sounds good. And I can slide under. Finally. That's so handy when I'm going to be running away um, from the zombies. I can craft a med kit. Thank you. Uh, anything else around? Sometimes when I'm running for a long time, I will just cut a little chunk out of the video just so it is eventful because I'm sure you guys would get bored if I'm just like running and running and collecting things and then running and collecting more things. <laughs> but if something's exciting and juicy, I'll show you for sure. At the moment, I'm just trying to get away and uh, go towards that safe zone. Uh, they seem to... I, I'm wondering how this game's going to progress later. Um, because the zombies aren't really chasing me at the moment. They're kind of walking around. I'm going to go into the building which we have just uh, saved and we have done our job for tonight. Oh, shit. Oh, I knew something was going to go down. I knew it wasn't going to be that easy. What's going on? Yeah. Hey, Doc. It's Kyle Crane. Chris, what can I do for you? I just saw this freaking weird zombie. He's covered in big green blisters. It, it hauled ass as soon as it spotted me. You know anything about it? <laughs> Not enough information, I'm afraid. But if you see another one, do let me know, will you? Okay. So it must be evolving or something. I don't know. This is getting <laughs> exciting. Uh, I don't know what's going on. I think now uh, I have to just sleep through the night. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode. If you have, give it a thumbs up and uh, let me know that you'd like me to continue it. And uh, I hope that you all had fun. I certainly did. I'm starting to get a bit scared. So <laughs> anyway, um, this will be fun. So um, check out my other videos if you haven't already. Sub if you haven't already. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye for now.